And here we go. We got ourselves a fleecy box over here, I should assume. Since it is in my intro and I've already seen this, I've just been pretending like this is all interesting. Uh, this is all new to me. Actually, I didn't actually know how to get here, but it was in my intro because somehow I made it here and decided to film it. Uh, looks like we got ourselves uh, some spiders up there. Some spoiders. Some bloody spiders. Uh, every time I say spiders, I think of Lord of the Rings uh, fighting that one. Oh, there's also a zombie. So clearly we got ourselves a situation here with a, a large amount of spiders. Uh, maybe we can go around here. We could easily just... Oh, 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 clever little ducky of me. I got myself a spider spawner. There we go. That's one down, but I'm assuming there must be multiple. Yeah, there is. Never suspect only one. There's probably more. Or never assume less from the greatest. Oh, and zombies can actually get through this two by do two door. And I died, and he laughs maniacally at my pain. So, uh, my bed was missing or obstructed because the game is not intelligent to respawn me in a place where I just slightly moved my bed. So, we're gonna go sprinting over here, uh, like any pansy would, uh, in the middle of the darkness, see if we can recover that coal and that iron sword and all that good stuff. Uh, I did indeed just get mauled by a zombie because I'm a pansy and I'm not used to hard mode. Uh, wow, two hearts. That's not so bad. But, uh, so I'm pretty sure, uh, we go down here, uh, which is where I found. Uh, I founded uh, the bridge to Terabithia, which is the island name over here, Terabithia. Uh, nope, it is lower down, and we are currently being chased by a skeleton of sorts. And I jump every time I hear him fire off something. So hopefully we can outmaneuver him uh, using stealth and cun cunning, 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 uh, and punch that spider in a hole, which was pretty epic. I just kind of freaked out because I was going to say cunning, but then I stopped, and then it sounded like I was going to say the unforgivable curse word. So that's always fun. Fun fact, kids, if you don't know what the unforgivable curse word is, then too bad because you're never going to know from here because I'm not going to tell you. Uh, it's probably not unforgivable, but it is the worst in my book, and I'm not quite sure why it's just so rarely said that while it is saved up there for rated R movies along with F words, it you gasp e when they say that. Oh, and there is indeed a spider that wasn't attacking me, but I decided to attack it anyway because I hate spiders. And he is, uh, I just crit him, which is pretty cool. Uh, please fall. Thank you. Uh, I'm gonna follow my torches here in hope of actually finding a bridge. Quite laggy over here indeed. I remember I did climb this, probably. We only have five minutes to recover our items, so I'm going to actually sprint, even though I disapprove of sprinting because I don't like lowering my health, and I almost died right there, but don't worry about it. So we're going to go back down here, nice little loop around, going to jump up here, look at all the pretty glowstone, see the box again, and somehow my flipping pickaxe got all the way over there. Now, while it is still uh, indeed a very uh, bright place, uh, very dark in here, and I'm going to put one glowstone, so this zombie spawner is hereby safe. So there was indeed a zombie spawner, but I didn't expect a zombie spawner at this point. It didn't seem likely. But indeed there is. Uh, we got that cleared. I'm going to go grab this uh, here. Uh, uh, axe right here. And there we go. We got ourselves a, uh, a hefty foothold in the uh, current situation. I probably should have grabbed some wood, but I was actually at spawn because my bed was missing slash obstructed. And we're going to jump down here and get myself an iron sword. Oh, goodness. I flicked my word syllables on that one, too. Uh, so, um, we got ourselves some magenta wool. I'm going to grab a whole uh, two rows of this because I'm cocky. And, uh... We're going to want to uh, check down here real quick. I'm not quite sure if there's any more items. This must be just all remnants of the same sort of fortress that we just questioned. <gasps> but indeed, there is not, good sir. We have indeed found the uh, legendary 
other intersection. I'm assuming this might be intersection two. Look at that voice crack. That was sexy. Uh, so we're going to go a questing over here and uh, see what's going on. We're probably not going to search the videos, but uh, just to clarify, look at that spiral staircase type junk that goes into the cave. And luckily we don't have to build as far for this one. Uh, so there we go, uh, one block too high. Uh, there are some holes though, so we're going to probably want to patch these up along the way. So crikey guys, we got ourselves to intersection 2 without doing anything in intersection 1. Uh, stop raining on me. You suck. I hope you die. So we got ourselves Classic Sky still. Um, that must be like a remake of the, or like just a copy pasta, copy paste of the original area uh, for a starter area. Intersection 2, uh, Ghost Town. Uh, which there is a video in my intro. It just looks like a normal town, so I'm unsure of the threat in that situation since, as you can see, a lot of it looks relatively intact. Uh, classic sky, we already looked at that. The under sky, uh, which is that ugly monstrosity of some discs over there. Uh, freaking whatever that ever is. And we got shredded sky, which uh, here looks like uh, classic sky, but a lot more platforming involved. So, I know I said that we probably weren't going to go into uh, any of these areas because uh, I have wool to return. But I'm going to add some of these items here. Uh, sign, two, and uh, all these things. Uh, and we're going to go questing. A questing of sorts. Uh, off into the distance. Wait, no we're not. No we're not. Time out. Uh, I think what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to conserve here. Uh, I don't think we nearly need this much glowstone in this area, so we're going to want to chop a lot of it in half. Um, what else do we can kind of like split these out and this and this and this and this. Okay, so, um, oh, I forgot to do this one. And it is indeed thundering now. Um, that sucks. So, um, let's see. Got ourselves plenty of glowstone. Uh, gonna grab one more, I guess. Put this glowstone dust in there. Uh, chomp on a little bit of bread. Uh, no, wait, not yet. Uh, and we're gonna go off of venturing, venturing out into the, uh, distance. We got a lot of monsters here up front, so this is probably not a good sign, and I don't have any building materials of sorts to smooth out this terrain, so we're going to want to build this out here, and we're probably going to want to go slay these monsters, which isn't going to end well, might I say. So that blew up. I, I It still scared me. I'm not going to lie. It, it was coming. I wasn't quite sure if he was going to blow up yet, uh, but he did in the end. Uh, which was thoroughly terrifying for everyone involved. I was like, is he? Is he? Is he? Oh, gosh, he did. And now we're being chased by monsters on all halves. And we're going to use our sprinting to our ability uh, here. Uh, do I have enough silk from the previous uh, area to actually build a bow eventually? Because I could use... I think I want to go to Super Mario Galaxy Land over there and actually... Oh, piss. Okay, so obviously that was going to happen no matter what, because as soon as I was like, let's go off to adventure in this incredibly difficult area um, where we will not likely survive, uh, we did indeed not survive. Now, I'm being chased by a creeper at the moment. Uh, um, luckily, we saved a lot of our uh, goods, except the food and the iron sword, which were probably the most important, other than the wool which getting to that wool over there will probably be more difficult than actually getting the wool of the dungeon. So it's been overall a very unproductive day, uh, in other words. And I have yet to see any of my trees grow, or I don't even remember where I grew my trees. Uh, being chased by a spider at the moment, in case you didn't notice. Gonna have to do some strafe jumping. Uh, I don't, I'm not quite sure what strafe jumping is, and I'm pretty sure that wasn't strafe jumping. But I'm going to call it strafe jumping anyway.
So that was a pretty epic strafe jump, guys. Do you see that nonsense? Uh, so we don't have any signs to update our current situation. And there is indeed a spider still in the vicinity, probably climbing the walls so he can eat our faces. Um, I guess what we do is uh, we're probably going to want to Cli we're probably going to want to get out here and uh, plant probably uh, a couple trees or one so we have it prepared for the future um, so that was a pretty eventful diary thing I can't actually find a sign oh oh um oh um uh uh, uh, um, uh, um, oh, my, gee, good golly. And there are saplings in there, but of course I cannot shift click and inspect an inventory, inventory at the same time. So, I think what my plan is, is we're going to make one quick run at the base. But, because I'm a jerk, I'm going to steal all of the signs here. So, we don't have to worry about this anymore. Uh, I should probably put a die counter, too, on how many deaths I have, in fact, had. Um, this is, in fact, my fourth death. I'm pretty sure I have died four times. Uh, so, that's, that's pretty cool. Uh, is there anything on this side? Nope. And we're just gonna go over here. I, I recommend far render distance. There's a big tree over there. Thanks, bro. Uh, I didn't know that. Um, so, we got a legitimate amount of signs here. I'm going to want to keep them there at all times. Or where my more frequent diary posts will be once I find a new location. That chest, I did glimpse at it. It does indeed have uh, saplings of every type in there. Four of each. Uh except maybe like desert saplings but I'm not quite sure what desert trees do so I don't really know about that I just know that there's uh, pine trees sort of uh, for wintry biomes and then we got uh, Asian trees which are the white ones I call them Asian trees I'm sorry that's just what they remind me of they remind me of Asians um ah holy crap on a oh crap oh crap oh crap so I'm probably gonna die here guys that's pretty cool. Oh, never mind. Uh, and then uh, once I post my diary update that I did indeed uh, die several times and that this is the Thursday episode of, or it's the Thursday series of Minecraft Land that I have been anticlimactic. Hopefully I'll get better, guys. I'm just a little unfocused. I'm going to do some resource farming while uh, not, like, watch while you guys aren't watching. I'm going to get rid of this real quick. Uh, gonna do found wool died horribly horribly twice uh what time is it 2 25 a.m. there we go no jokes involved on this one but there you go uh, eventful and then we're going to put Thursday. Alright so guys uh, it's been a very uh, disappointing series of episodes but um, I guess it makes up because I actually made the intro for the previous episodes um, so take it easy guys uh, I'll see you on more failures of adventures. Oh we got some grown trees over there uh, so that's cool uh, see you guys later